morning, this is the Breville Oracle. I've just turned it on and added some beans and water and I'm going to quickly do a double shot latte. So the machine usually takes about 10 minutes, 5 to 10 minutes to warm up. Um, it's already warmed up so it's up to the 93 degrees which is the default. Um, let me grab a cup. What I like to do before every session is uh, run a blank shot, so just to warm up the machine some more and warm up the handle and the cup, so just press the double shot button. Keep this on the side for now. Um, I'm gonna grab a tissue. Did you handle it and dry it? Now we're gonna start grinding. So grinding on this machine is very easy. You just put the handle here and you twist. It will grind for you, it will dose for you and it will actually tamp and press the coffee for you. Which no other machine does. Here it is, fully polished uh, and ready to go. Um, if you needed to go coarser, you just twist this dial up. So it's at number eight now. I don't know if you can see. Grind size number eight, the finest being number one. Um, and even when you run out of numbers, there's an internal mechanism on the burr, on the blade, um, that allows you to go even finer. So this is at number eight. Try it twisted but not too hard. Um, so we usually set at 6 o'clock or 5 o'clock. I got my milk jug here. I recommend getting a milk jug that's... The uh, best one is like the steel or the metal, metal ones. But if, uh, if you don't have that and you want to use something temporarily, you can use like glass or ceramic just in the meantime. Uh, something that conducts heat pretty well, not plastics. Um, yeah, so this is a jewel, so you can brew coffee and make milk at the same time. Also recommend before doing it, steaming your milk to purge it, to get out all that steam and get rid of that um, condensed water. Just like that, so the steam is fresh. Uh, here you can adjust the sort of the temp the temperature and the um, the texture of the milk. So if you want it closer to a cappuccino, you go up. Closer to a latte, you go down. I like it closer. I like it in the middle actually, um, and I like it at 60 degrees Celsius, which is the default. So I'm going to keep it in the middle. And you press down to start frothing. Um, I'm not going to start just yet. I just want to do one more thing. So here's my mug, it's fully warmed up with the hot water. I'm gonna dump out all that hot water. Here is a hot spout, hot water spout. You 
can use this to warm up your mugs if you're doing more than one cup. Um, I personally use it to add sugar to my cup uh, before the espresso. You can also use it to make Americanos, which is the actual, the, actual uh, the intended use for it. So you can press this button. I've never used it, by the way. So you can like sort of make a long black. So you put your coffee here. You press this button. It will dispense the hot water, and then it will dispense the espresso. So that sort of the same way that the baristas make the long black or a, um, an Americano. Here's my sugar mixed up and ready to go. You can also use the whole water spat to like brew tea, etc. Yeah, so I'm gonna just press the double shot button. You can also use a scale to sort of gauge how uh, how fun or how coarse you should do your grinder. Uh, a double shot usually is about. 35 to 45 grams of espresso and 20 grams of ground coffee but you don't need to measure the ground coffee because it does it for you I'm gonna do the milk first because milk takes longer than espresso you want them to finish roughly at the same time about 35, I'm gonna add a bit more. Quickly um, grab a wet towel. And when I take the milk out, I'm going to immediately wipe the, the wand. Immediately clean this because if you don't, the milk will stick on it and it will be very difficult to, to clean later on. The wand gets very hot, so the milk will want to stick to it. When you push it down, it will purge and clean itself, so... Cool. Here's my milk. You can swirl it, knock it, break any bubbles if there, if there are any. So it's all done. Here's my espresso. Here's my latte. Um, hope you enjoy the machine. I'll see you very soon. Cheers.